Drop the roof and let the smoke clear. I got diamonds doing till the slides in both ears. Dice falling on the Las Vegas trip tonight. Slip that on and we might miss the fight. Fuck a night, I keep the quality in my shorty bag. It's your girl Jam and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today the girls are going to be spending the day with me, okay? As you can see, I just went through the car wash and I vacuumed my car. Y'all never again. Never again. I didn't even like, usually my boyfriend will wash my car and stuff like that. But I was like, nah, I'm going to do it. I'm going to go through the drive through because I got a little free little coupon. Because where I get my oil changes from, I get a free coupon for a car wash. So I was like, I'm going to do that. I was like, why not? I'm about to go out of town. Why not vacuum my car? Girl, I am wore out, girl. I think I got sweat between my chest, girl. Right now, I'm trying this Vox Vitamin D water. It says it got citrus fruit essence in it. I need it. I need it because, child, that wore me out never again. I was sweating. I feel all my hair. On my roots sweating. But this is actually really good. It's zero sugar, zero calories. I just don't like when you drink so much of it. Like the citrus essence. It's like, it's way too much. But yeah, y'all. I just went to the dollar store. I really like these wild cherry little trees. And so I'm just about to replace the ones I have. It smells so good. And my car is like so fresh. And I ain't do the most. I ain't wiped down. Well, I guess I threw that one away. But I didn't wipe down no dust. I didn't do the most with the vacuum. And I just vacuumed the seats and the floors. And that was it. Like, my car needs to be detailed. I didn't do that in years. And I see why. I see why. I'm never doing that again. Never doing that again. I'm going to go to Don's Car Wash and pay the little $20 or whatever it is. $16, $20. To have them wash and vacuum my car. Because... That's not worth it. That's not worth my back hurt. That's not worth it. But y'all. I try to replace the little tree things every few weeks. Like when I stop smelling it. But they really smell good, y'all. Hold on. I'm about to go throw this away. Y'all, OMG. I kind of did a little jaw because it's starting to rain. Oh my goodness, but but me and my sisters, we're about to go out of town. You girls is going to the fair today. I don't know if I'm going to get on any rides, but I definitely know I want the food. We're going to go to the mall. The girls need a little retail therapy, okay? They got a H&M and a Fever 21 there that I want to visit. And the Sephora was closing, but the girl told me that they was going to open it in Kohl's. I don't remember the day, but if it's already open, I'm going to go to Sephora and get me some Nars foundation. If not... I'm going to check out their Ulta and see if they got it. But I'm going to try to see what H&M got. They don't have a, a Zara or Urban Outfitters. That's another one of my favorite stores. And the closest one is Houston. So I'm going to just go see what H&M got. And right now I got to go back home and go get ready. But I'm trying to think, do I want to get Starbucks? Because I still got a little gift card, honey, okay? I may need to go get a refresher. Or maybe I should go to Starbucks before I get on the road. Like, maybe I should go home, get dressed, and then go to Starbucks. Because one of my sisters riding with me. And 
I probably should like drink Starbucks for the road, you know. And I just can't wait. I'm thinking about stopping and getting some booty balls in Scott because they have like some of the best booty balls. Or I could stop to Rabbitohs and get a kebab. That's probably what I'm going to do. Yeah, I think I'm going to stop to Rabbitohs. But it's starting to rain out here. So if we get to Lafayette and by the time we're ready to go to the FAF, it's raining. We just go go see Little Mermaid because my niece, she really want to see... Um, the little mermaid so yeah that's on the agenda for the day don't forget to like comment and subscribe for the vibes because we're gonna have a good time honey but yeah let's go get ready okay y'all so i done made it home but i'm about to do this unboxing this sweet young lady has sent me a package and i just want to unbox it with the girls And so, the company is called Yanni Holistics. OMG, this is so cute. I'm going to show y'all. And it's in such a big old box. This is the cutest thing. If you can see. Thank you, Yanni Holistic. It's skincare and wellness. This is super cute. This is the thank you card. Super duper cute. Screenshot the details. And we're going to see what's inside. I love the packaging, y'all. Oh my God. This is super duper cute. The satin bag. Oh my God. She sees so much stuff. This is the Yanni Holistics Rose Bar. It nourishes and cleanses the skin. It's an herbal vaginal cleanser. This is the Yanni Mist. This is super cute. It's so much in here. This is the Divine Feminine Yanni Balancing Oil. Cute! I'm super excited. Yanni steam herbs. So I guess this is like the tub you use. And this is some sage. This is a feminine wash and Yanni steam herbs. That's all inside here. OMG, it also comes with a roll. Oh, y'all, this is super cute. And I love me a. I love me a good robe, honey. Oh, yes, ma'am. Okay, I see you. And I got some more stuff in here, y'all. It comes with these pretty little crystals in there. This is super, super cute. And a candle. Okay, that's it. This is from Tanisha Lloyd. Y'all, this is her information. Go ahead and screenshot it. And I will link. I will link the information below. On her Instagram. You can also screenshot this. With the barcode. Thank you, Yanni Holistics, for sending me this. This is super, super cute. Uh, the Basically, what the brand is, it says her products will detox the wound, restore and balance pH soothe itching and dryness and eliminate unusual odor her instagram is yanni holistics y'all thank y'all so much y'all go check my girl out she sent me all this cute stuff if you want to send me something i'll continue to share unboxings on my youtube channel so you can send things to my p.o box i will have it linked in the description below but i have to get ready for the fair y'all so let me do that and i'll get back with y'all once i'm done getting ready okay y'all so i'm done getting dressed this is a full look from h&m right now i'm using this victoria's secret hardcore rose lotion to lotion like my skin where i'm gonna spray perfume at today's scent is mon perry why sell mon perry And y'all, this was in my H&M haul. I really love this shirt because it's giving spring and summer. 
I really love it. And I just put my hair up in a claw clip because it's hot. And I'm wearing jeans and a long sleeve shirt, but it's very, very thin. And yeah, I just... I can't stop over. I love this. I can't stop overdoing it. But I like to spray my perfume before I put on my watch because I don't want to stain my watch. But wear my coach watch, my uh, gold chain, just some hair store studs. Um, oh, and my shoes are pretty, pretty Little Thing. These little cute shoes from Pretty Little Thing. And these are like some wide leg pants. Yeah, I love the look. I wish I would have curled my hair because I just feel like it's not coming together how I want. But I wanted this like messy claw clip look. Maybe if I keep teasing it and then it'll fall in place. But I think I should have curled it. But let me know what y'all think about the look in the comments. And yeah, I'm off to the fair, but it's been storming. So like I said, we do have a plan B. To do some shopping and then go see Pretty Little Thing if it's storming in Lafayette by the time we get there. But out here, honey, it looks like the sun is coming out again. But it was just thunderstorming and raining so hard and I just washed my car. Like, soon as I left from washing my car, it starts to get dark. And, like, if you see, like, when I was at the dollar store, how it was starting to, like, drizzle. It started raining super, super hard by the time I got my house. Thank you, God. But, yeah, I'm bringing my next butter gloss and my fenty beauty um lip gloss as well this is in the shade sweet mouth i'm also bringing my laneige because i don't know i just feel like i don't know if i'm gonna want to keep using this the whole time and today since we're gonna be moving around i'm bringing my book sack and i just got like everything in here like my wallet oh i need to put my perfume in here too i don't got a travel size one but yeah, I got like Advil, hand sanitizer, my edge brush, my regular brush, just in case I got to do anything different with my hair, some gum, and I'm going to be rocking this for the aesthetics. So yeah, I think this is super, super cute, and maybe, hopefully, I can get a good picture, but I like to carry this like this, but since we're going to be at the fair... I just feel like I need my book sack, but it's black. So now I know I got to invest in a brown book sack. But yeah, I'm ready to go. I got everything I need. So see y'all soon. Okay, y'all. I got you want your own. What? I got you want your own. Oh. <laughs> oh, she said she ready to rock and roll. So, yeah, I stopped to Rabbitohs and I got me a fried kebab. It has a uh, bell pepper, onion, a Rabbitohs sausage, and chicken. But it looked like they burnt the corner of my kebab. But it's so good. I'm so hungry. But I'm about to eat this and get on a roll. Much too good for children. And I just fell in love with a gangster. So he put my name in the top. But I don't let him come to the crib. So we get it on where we at. Nowadays I be dunking them cameras. And they hype that I'm up on them banners. Calling my phone, but they know I don't answer. In the hood, I'm like Princess Diana. I'm thick cause I be eating oats. Bitch not taking shit from me, but notes. Wanna be me, so she do my emotes and my name in her mouth, so I bet she gon' choke. Tell her man I'm the girl of his dreams. Think about me when he brushing his teeth. He keep texting, I'll leave him on scene. How to switch on, they know what I mean. Know what I mean. Okay, so I'm gonna get the windbreaker shorts. And the satin dress with the cow neckline. And my normal fitted fitted shirts that I always get. Working on a weekend like usual. Way off in the deep end like usual. Niggas swear they passed us, they doing too much. Haven't done my taxes, I'm too turned up. Virgil got a paddock on my wrist going nuts. Niggas caught me slipping once, okay, so what? Someone hits a block up, I'd say if it was us. Man, a house in Rosewood, this shit too flush. Say my day's a number, but I keep waking up. <laughs> Why do you think they can read what that's 
my favorite thing to get is a chicken on a stick, and so I'm about to try this. Chicken on a stick, if you can see it. That's the chicken on a stick in the window, so I'm about to get it. Oh, you're not in it.